Okay, the fourth and final part. Yes. Sorry it took so long, but stupid, stupid YouTube. Stupid. Extreme G3. Don't have the first two, but this is very fun racing game. Got a blockbuster and it's in crappy condition. Oh well. Maybe I should replace that with the Jimmy Neutron case. <laughs> that case is good. It seems busted in now. Um, the reason I don't play it so that much, didn't play it that much, was because because of the m amount of space this game takes. It's a f great game, but look how look how many uh look how many blocks it takes. I don't know if my camera can pick it up. Oh, there we go. 161 blocks of space. Are you kidding me? That's more. That's that's more space. That's a, as much space as a black memory card for the GameCube. It's ridiculous. I don't have my uh, black memory card, but this is a pretty good game, I guess. All right. Zelda Wind Waker. Um, very good game. Very good. They thought it would suck because of the uh, uh, cell, uh, cell, cell uh, shading, um, which was kind of new at the time. Um, only 12 blocks of memory, but this is a great game. But the only problem with it is the navigation. I can't figure it out with the sailboat. It's it's either me or it's just, I don't know what, I, it, it's, it's, I think it's me not knowing what I'm doing. <laughs> this is funny. Big mother truckers. It's funny. It's a, it's like, uh, it's like a, uh, almost like, um, it kind of reminds you of, crap, I can't forget, I forget the name, but, uh, um, it, you just drive the truck to these, uh, designated places, and, uh, and you listen to the radio, it's so funny, there's this swearing hillbilly and stuff, and, uh, the characters and dialogue, and you can get a lot of, uh, upgrades and stuff, but this isn't only released on GameCube, it's released on other platforms as well. Ooh, nice. <laughs> Okay, this is an underrated game. SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Bikini Bottom. Awesome game. Very good. I usually hate THQ mainly because of that piece of crap. I keep talking about it, but it's just ridiculous. But um um this it, this is an awesome game like it, it sort of reminds you of Banjo Kazooie has such great exploration, and the characters are funny, and it has all the voice acting and stuff. And you do all these missions, and it's pretty fun. I recommend it. Okay, getting to the final two. This is also underrated. SpongeBob SquarePants movie video game. Um, you think it would be bad because, well, it's a movie-based game, and they usually suck. Um, unlike, unless it's like GoldenEye or uh, Jurassic Park or something, but uh, pretty fun. It's like Battle for Bikini Bottom, but it's different missions based on the movie. It's pretty fun. Okay, the last game. Mega Man Anniversary Collection. I just got this recently, and it's gone up dramatically on eBay. Yeah, I replaced the case with Jimmy Neutron, but... uh. Yeah, um, pretty fun game by Capcom. Um, yeah, it's a tribute to Mega Man. Um, has all uh, eight Mega Mans, one th one through six on the NES, seven on the Super Nintendo, and eight on the PlayStation. And uh, but there's only one problem with the GameCube port. Um, it swapped the buttons for the jump and shooting by 
the B jumps and A shoots. It should be the opposite, I think, because, well, look at the controller. Um, it's just, um, uh, you can't have the jump button be B. <laughs> B, B. But, uh, it has uh, also extra features, but this is pretty good. I got this recently for 8 bucks, so I couldn't complain. Alright, that's all my games, but, uh... Here's some of my accessories, and I think the uh, GameCube controller is the best controller. It, it has the best analog stick. It, it, it's just very comfortable to hold, and it doesn't slip. And it's just very, it's just very good design. And there's a camera button, sort of like on the uh, N64 controller, where you move around the camera, camera stick. Uh, and the B and A, they just feel comfortable and X, Y. And there's a Z button and L and R triggers. Best controller ever invented. And I have uh, three of them. One, two, and three. And here's some of the accessories. Like that memory card. And the uh, Game Boy Player. This uh, You have to have a special disc. And the uh, Game Boy Player that plays all Game Boy games. On the GameCube, except WarioWare, uh, Twisted, and Kirby Tilt and Tumble, because you would have to twist the, uh, um, you would have to twist the uh, GameCube. <laughs> and uh, here's a microphone for Mario Party Seven. I just got this because it was a dollar. And the Game Boy Advance adapter. I mean, yeah. Um, you just plug this in, and you can put Game Boy games on here. And here's some extra memory cards. Okay, that's my GameCube collection. And hopefully YouTube will accept this. And um, the GameCube is the most underrated system of all time. You can get these for cheap, like I said. And has some of the best games I have ever played. And I think it's ten times better than the Wii. I don't care about virtual console or motion controls. All I care about is good are good games. Um it's so underrated and um yep. Very good system. And here's the uh box. I got my first GameCube with Oh, such good memories. I still play the GameCube. So it's not like I uh don't play it. Well, that was my collection, and uh, please rate, subscribe, and this is Mario Luigi, finally, signing out.